Fairview, Espenshade, Cherry Hill, Gross Grove, Carpenters Crossing, Pilots Crossing, Plymouth Place Junction, and Paradise, Pennsylvania. Now folks, if you aren't intending to go to any of those places, you are on the wrong train.
top of the world famous Amazing Maze Corn Maze. The objective is to find your way from one end of the five acre corn field to the other without getting lost. Music, food, 50 farm fun attractions, a petting zoo, and fun for the entire family. Just follow the path from our way to grow for a short distance to the entrance. There is a separate mission chart from there on in. The Adventure Farm is open late May farmers are adapting their farms to help preserve farmland in the face of ever increasing development pressures. Yeah. <laughs> 
Um, no, folks. That's no way to go. Why we pay that ghost twenty-seven dollars and fifty cents a day to blow that whistle back at us? That does make the ghost the highest-paid employee on this railroad. Now, no one's ever claimed to see the ghost, but we do know that she exists because someone keeps cashing all those checks. Now, just across the crossing, up on the hill on the left-hand side, behind the stone wall, is the graveyard. One of the oldest in Lancaster County. It is Barry Marie Cherie, a French Huguenot who fled France in the early 1700s to escape religious persecution. She and her followers fled France for England where they obtained a land grant for two and a half square miles of land for William Penn when they arrived here in 1712. It was they who named their colony Paradise. Now back then, nearly 300 years ago, this was America's frontier and only Marie Cherie, her followers, and the Pequa Indians were here at this time. Now you folks at the head end of the train will notice we're starting to go over a bit of a field and soon we'll be crossing over the railroad's one and only bridge. We certainly hope that you don't see it because after all it is supposed to be underneath us. That bridge is about 16 feet long and does span over the ever possibly pumping hill turnpike. You'll know it because it'll be the darkest third road underneath our train. Please don't block your car when your car goes over the bridge. And two, when you see that third road, when you feet up off the floor, you'll be discovered that it takes some weight off the train and over at least the stress of train off.
bag is still running. And now, all aboard for Strasburg. It's an uphill climb most of the way back to the station. Our locomotive, our engineer, and especially our fireman will be working very hard to get us back. We'll let them do all the hot, hard, and very dirty work as we sit back, relax, and enjoy the sights and sounds and smells of old-time steam railroading here on the road to paradise.
only said last train of the day, folks, because I can promise you it's a very long walk back to Strasbourg. Picnic passengers and Cherry Crest Adventure Farm passengers, this is your stop. If you wish to get off at the Picnic Road, please call me exit where you should see a uniform trainman, a step box, and an open gate. Please do not open the gate on your own if it's not safe to do so. Also, please bear in mind that you'll be uh, here for a minimum of one half hour. So remain on board unless you are having a picnic or are visiting the Cherry Crest Adventure Farm. To reach the farm, follow the path for the short from the road for the short distance and be careful when crossing the road to the entrance where there is a separate emission fee and get back on any later train. Please note that the train only stops at an hour for the road and it makes itself. As soon as we have passengers on and off, and as soon as the eastbound train passes us, we will resume our journey back to East Coast Station.